Phantom number 23 dropped recently, and everyone who isn't a diehard Symbio fan asked, Who on earth is this Brenwater kid, and how is he Toxin? Okay, for those of you who don't know, Toxin is the grandchild of Venom. Yes, Carnage actually reproduced. And the Toxin symbiote is unique because it is the thousandth generation of Venom slime, which is not a good thing. Thousandth generation symbiotes tend to go mad, so Toxin first bonded with a police officer by the name of Patrick Mulligan. Toxin is pretty different from Venom or Carnage. For starters, Toxin is a very childish symbiote. This dynamic between him and Patrick can only be described as a parent dealing with an edgy child. When your ground rules are no arson, grand larceny, or homicide, the only place you can go is up. Too bad Marvel had Patrick killed off after the Toxin miniseries and handed him to Eddie Brock. That was stupid. All you need to know is that Brock loses the symbiote eventually, which makes its way to Bren. Bren first debuted in the King in Black event, specifically King in Black Planet of the Symbiotes number 3. He doesn't actually fight any symbiotes in that event, instead he's facing off against a member of the Brood. Except this isn't a member of the Brood. Toxin is ultimately fighting the wrong guy since the Brood member was actually a human experimented on by Alchemax. This isn't over since Guardsman proceeds to fight Toxin. Toxin is on the defensive, which makes sense, because Bren's father is the Guardsman. Bren is young, possibly 14 or 15 since he stated he doesn't have a learner's permit. Bren would later play a role facing off against the re-emergent Carnage during the storyline Extreme Carnage. The other symbiote heroes shrugged him off as just being a kid bonded to a dangerous creature. This would also be his last appearance for a while. Then in 2022, he made a cameo during the Spider-Man Venom Free Comic Book Day issue as a member of Dylan Brock's symbiote team. In 2023, Venom number 23 is where we leave this video off. Bren tracks down Dylan and interrogates him about Alchemax employees, and then they go to rescue off seemingly lobotomized children. This is where we currently must leave off. If you like this video, please consider liking, subscribing, and tipping the channel on Kofi.